my name is Dean Burdick. I work for Illinois Toolworks and I'm manufacturing lead. I've been doing all thread rolling everything for 27 years. The mule takes a lot of guesswork out of setting up a machine. Everything is straightforward. It's by thou everything's set by thousands instead of uh, fine tuning with a little tap here, a little tap there for pressure. It's going to help change the industry. It changes the way we set up a part because after you get a running recipe, it's pretty much you go to that recipe, measure what you're doing, your dies. Once you get them in, it gives you the basic formula that you used before and you just fine tune it in. It, it's a lot faster and quicker. It's going to speed up all your training because all the witchcraft and voodoo that we used to put into how we set up a machine, it takes all that out and just puts it straight forward into simple numbers. After working with the mule, I think it is a lot easier to run than a standard thread roller. Our uptime has increased because our setup time has decreased. So the, the faster we can set it up and get it running is the more parts that we can put out. And it's less adjustments after we get it running. When the dies start wearing, it keeps uniform pressure on it. So we have to do less fine tuning of bringing up pressures. Well, some setups could take up to 45 minutes to an hour with fine tuning. The mule reduces most of your harder setups down to less than 20 minutes. Most of the jobs that they run on the quarter inch machines here, you're normally running about 225 pieces a minute. I can run at about 260 a minute. I have seen on certain parts die life increasing. Yes, uh, semi gimlet parts, I've gotten up to over 2 million parts on a die. The insulation on a mule took less than an hour. To go through the training, we spent about two hours training on the different plates and the discs. And after that, I got fairly efficient after about the second setup I did. Learning how to use it after I installed it was fairly easy. I would say it's one of the easiest things I've done. Mm -hmm.